Hey, if you like this video, uh, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell, uh, just like this. All right, so uh, this is going to be another quick video on uh, my series of uh, rarest uh, comic books uh, in my collection. Uh, this one's actually very rare. Um, it's uh, by Steve Ditko, um, it's Mr. A. And uh, just a quick note, if you're not familiar with, uh, I've never heard of Mr. A. Um, one way to explain uh, that character, um, if you know the question, uh, the character, uh, he the question is basically a comic code uh, approved version of Mister A, basically, not exactly, but yeah, that's a way to explain it. Uh, this one is very rare. Uh, it's one also uh, one of the few characters I guess Ditko got to keep. Uh, I guess till he died. Uh, as far as ownership to it, rights to it, um, I think it's all everything done by him, story, art, publishing, and all the stuff. So uh, it, it makes it a very unique book, yeah, and that's why I make videos like this. It's just yeah, the fact that it's rare, but there's for me to get it, it has to be something unique about it as well. And being a big Spider-Man and a Ditko fan. When I had a chance uh, to get it, I got it. So let's take a look at it. Uh, hope you enjoy it. One thing occurs to me. I really cannot let the week go without commenting on Steve Ditko. Steve was certainly one of the most important creators in the comic book business. And his talent was indescribable. I worked with him for many years and was always impressed with how he saw everything in terms of photos and pictures and movement and scenes. And he, he just... He told the story like like a fine movie uh, director would, and I think that he will be very greatly missed by the public and by his fans. And I'm sure there'll be a lot written about him as time goes by. And I will be one of the guys who buys the first book. You made a real impression here in the world. Exosia. All right, all right, all right. So, uh, this is a very interesting book. Um, I got it a while back and this is another book that I got from overseas uh, actually um, sometimes some rare books uh, they don't become available very often uh, I guess part of being rare <laughs> uh, but this one I, I was very lucky uh, a lot of times some of the books I have uh, I'll tell you um, I've been very lucky uh, this one is pretty high grade and this is Mr. A, uh, 1973. That's uh, typical stories, cover, and art. Um, and uh, as you've seen by now, uh, I'm a big uh, Spider-Man fan, a uh, big uh, Steve uh, fan as well. Uh, but this is one of the more original uh, comics 
from his point of view, I guess, uh, that he, I believe he kept the rights to it. And that's to the time he died. Uh, he, he did the whole thing on it. And let me show you the back too, because this one actually has some stuff in the back. So if you're not familiar with the character. Uh, I'm not going to go over in much detail because it's kind of a complex uh, character. Uh, you see him there with a mask. And the mask is basically kind of a, his face, but like frozen. <laughs> and uh, he, he was kind of controversial in the sense that um, he's very, I guess, black and white. Uh, some of the stories uh, are kind of interesting, but uh, this one is basically a collection. This is not the first appearance. Uh, it's more like a collection of the other stories. I think he first appeared in 1967, I believe, or so. Um, but again, this is a very rare book. And being a, a Steve fan, um, I, I had to get it when I had a chance to get it. Because I, honestly, I don't know when anything like this will be for sale again. I only know one person that has a similar book. I forgot the grade that he has, but it's Reggie. Uh, if you watch your YouTube, you probably know Reggie. <laughs> uh, but that's the only person I know personally that has a book like this. Uh, this is a 9.4 white pages, which is always great. And I believe there's five, only five above this one. But even on the total census, there's only 22. And when I say numbers like this, and you're going to see on the other videos, I'm talking about just on the census. Uh, sometimes I say, oh, there's five at this grade or, or, or 15,000. I'm talking about like in the census. Sometimes there may be more books, but I'm just talking about the census. Uh, but this one's only 22 total and five, only five above this one. Um, I don't remember how much I pay for it, honestly. It's it's been a while, but I think uh, it's probably still available. Or if you can find, for whatever the person wants to sell it now, because see, uh, you you kind of name your price, uh, because there's not that many available. But I, I'm pretty sure it's under a thousand bucks, maybe even under five hundred bucks or so. I don't remember, but uh, it wasn't that much. I was surprised because it's a very rare book. But as I explained before on my videos, just a rare book doesn't mean it's going to be an expensive book. I mean, some cases like the 9.9 .9 there, yeah, there's a lot of those, uh, Secret Wars 8, but not many on 9.9. .9. And But there's a lot of demand for it. This one, um, I would think there would be more demand, but uh, I guess not so much. A lot of people are not familiar with Mr. A. I mean, it's not like a Marvel or DC a book that's published by them or anything like that but it, it, it's very interesting so uh, you haven't seen uh, this before and that's the reason I, I make these videos uh, some of the rare books they may not be as popular as uh, some other books so but it's still a nice piece of history and again uh, as most of these videos I'm just doing for myself for future reference because uh, 1973, yeah, maybe in a few more years I'll be looking back and see, oh, I'm glad I got this. <laughs> oh, well. So, yeah, uh, I'll put a link because there's a video I saw on YouTube the other day. And, and that's what reminded me to do a, a video about this one. Uh, a guy did a video explaining more about Mr. A. I'll, I'll put the link below. So if you want to know more about him, you can always Google. But there's a video the guy goes over more about the character itself, um, um, their philosophy, I guess, and how it was created. So check that out. I don't know the guy. I'll, I'll do this research and I'll put the link below. Okay, uh, as usual, uh, any questions or comments, just write below. Uh, if you like Mr. A or if you never heard of him, uh, just let me know and if there's any rare books uh, you've seen in my collection you want me to show next let me know as well uh, I have a, quite a few more books to go through but I can only do one a week or so okay uh, thank you okay bye